Okay. So uh, the early Roman calendar, it consisted of 10 months and had 304 days. Wow, okay, so a- only had 304 days. So the year was a squeak. So yeah, so the two months they, they lost two months. I hope one of those I hope they didn't lose August. That's my birthday. Mom. Yeah, that's me and Chrissy's birthday. Yeah. With each new year beginning at the vernal equinox. I mean, Mike's using big words here. And Mike's also checked out right now, fucking texting. No, uh, kind of oh, I thought you were texting it too. No. Yeah. Okay. Um over the centuries, the calendar fell out of sync with the sun. Did it, Chrissy? Yeah, because they fucked up the math. Why why? Because there weren't Chinese kids around back then to do the math. <laughs> <laughs> That's look That's the they left paper it, to copy over. They yeah. left it up to a bunch of fucking Greek inbred incest fucks to do the math. And they those the Greek kids can't do math. Yeah, but the kids But the Chinese kids can do the math. But guess what? Everything Roman is based on Greek. And yeah. listen, and everything in the world is based on the Roman. So a Greek people live at everything. Yeah. Because yeah. even the fucking astronomer that Julius Caesar used to fucking consult with to figure out his fucking calendar was a Greek kid named something Jerus. I think it was fucking a Jerus boy. Yeah, it's just what it is. Yeah, his name was Panayotis Yeras. Yeah, I love that. I love that. Yeah, the way Giannis fucking yells about how mighty the Greeks are. And he drives a Ford Fusion. Yes, look at us. Yeah, it's just what it is. Malaka. Okay. Um, so the Julian calendar was introduced by Julius Caesar, who was a great fucking kid, Julius yeah. Caesar, with a great haircut. He had a lot of good ideas. He had a lot of good ideas. So Julius Caesar, he wanted to solve the problem, and he consulted with prominent astronomers and the mathematicians of his time. But again, they weren't Chinese kids. There weren't gay kids or, or Chinese kids, so you can't have good astronomers or good mathematicians if you don't have the gays and the Chinese. The gays fucking love signs, what sign you are, and the, and the Chinese love to numbers. To yeah, some so gay, to yeah, some guys like to bug chase, too. Yeah, it's what, yeah. <laughs> You're a fucking bug chaser. I was, I'm, I'm a reformed bug chaser. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So, um, we've had many calendars. We've had many calendars other than the, the, the Julian calendar, which we use now. Um, we've had the, uh, the Babylonian calendar, gross. Uh, Hebrew calendar, yuck. Yeah. Egyptian calendar, gross. Greek calendar, gross. Chinese calendar, gross. Yeah. Yeah, um, Venetian. Wait, yeah, 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 yeah. Like always, it's the Catholic Church that came in here and messed everything up. Mm-hmm. <laughs> because everybody was okay. They were okay with this, you know, with, with, uh, with the year being a little longer or whatever. And then the, the Catholic Church is the one that came in and they said, hey, we don't like this because we want to make sure our religious holidays are celebrated on their actual days. Yeah. Like it matters. Like it matters. Like it fucking matters. Yeah. So All right. in October 1582, Pope Gregory took it upon himself to resolve this problem, and that's when the Gregorian calendar came to be. Yeah. So yeah. right now, what is it? It's a combination of the Julian and Gregorian. It's a combination of all, uh, like, the Hebrew, the Chinese. Um, so it's kind of, like, evolved. It's a, We have a trans calendar. Yeah. In a way. Our calendar's trans. Yeah. No, it's not trans. It's... it's a it, calendar. It's a, it's a calendar. It's not it's different. Tr- it's okay. not trans. It's okay. a calendar. Okay. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Yeah. All right, listen. That was actually a great fucking moment right there. That was about calendars? Yes. So listen. We really hope you enjoyed that episode, whatever it was about. This is just a stock thing that we're taping onto every episode. So go make sure you rate, review us, subscribe, uh, turn on your notifications, get jiggy with it. And go to patreon.com slash Bay Ridge Boys where things get really wild.